Lindsay was shocked. It was her 45th birthday and she was putting on her favorite necklace when she felt a lump in her throat. Not the nervous kind, but an actual nodule on the side of her neck where her thyroid is. Well, fear doesn't begin to describe what Lindsay felt at first. Could she have cancer? If so, what would that mean? But she doesn't have any symptoms. So she started researching thyroid cancer and got herself all freaked out looking at the unprofessional sites out there. But in talking with her best friend, a nurse, Lindsay realized that a nodule on the thyroid can mean a lot of things. In fact, 90% of the time, it's not cancer. So she made an appointment to see an endocrinologist. This thyroid specialist would be able to examine her and run some tests and tell her for sure. While she is waiting for her appointment, Lindsay goes to hormone.org so that she can get factual information on the signs and symptoms of thyroid cancer. Lindsay learns that one of the reasons thyroid cancer often goes undetected is because of the lack of thyroid cancer symptoms. In its early stages, most patients experience no symptoms of thyroid cancer. As it progresses, patients may experience neck or throat pain, problems swallowing, lumps felt through the skin on the neck, changes to the voice, swollen lymph nodes in the neck. Lindsay learns about some of the risk factors for thyroid cancer, such as radiation treatments to the head, neck, or chest, particularly when the patient is a child, family history of thyroid cancer, a large or rapidly growing nodule, older than 40, during the examination, the endocrinologist tells her that there are four types of thyroid cancer. Papillary, the most common type. Follicular, the second most common type. Together, affecting more than 95% of thyroid cancer patients. And medullary and anaplastic, two very uncommon forms of thyroid cancer. If it turns out that she does have cancer, there are several treatment options. And the good news is that thyroid cancer is treatable and most thyroid cancers are very curable. Lindsay leaves the appointment feeling reassured. She'll have her results in a few days, but knows that in all likelihood, it's going to be okay. If you have any symptoms or risk factors of thyroid cancer, visit hormone.org to learn more.